Aoka is next, and they're followed by Blast of Magic. Over on the far side is no speed limit. They're spread right across a furling and a half to go. Adams Barber is the leader from Tassel Flower. Blast of Magic begins a run with no speed limit. Poets Pride, early call weakens, then it's all a joke and brave display. Still in front is Adams Barber. No speed limit on the far side. They're going to the line. Adams Barber. Adams Barber beat no speed limit. And Blast of Magic third. Aoka is next, and they're followed by Blast of Magic. Over on the far side is no speed limit. They're spread right across a furling and a half to go. Adams Barber is the leader from Tassel Flower. Blast of Magic begins a run with no speed limit. Poets Pride early call weakens, then it's all a joke and brave display. Still in front is Adams Barber. No speed limit on the far side. They're going to the line. Adams Barber. Adams Barber beat no speed limit. And Blast of Magic third. Two and a half furlongs to go, it's Happy Lad. With challenging in the diamond colors, Falak being followed by Sam Missile, Nightly Wailing, Persian Line Final Orders. In behind them is No Thanks, a furling and a half to go. And it's Happy Lad, strongly pressed by Falak, the Nightly Wailing, Sam Missile, Liam and Mountain Fox. Final Orders is next, and up to the finish, it's Falak in the lead from Happy Lad, Nightly Wailing. And Falak is going to back up his January win here, beating Nightly Wailing and Happy Lad. No Thanks was up for fourth. Two and a half furlongs to go, it's Happy Lad. With challenging in the diamond colors, Falak being followed by Sam Missile, Nightly Wailing, Persian Line Final Orders. In behind them is No Thanks, a furling and a half to go. And it's Happy Lad, strongly pressed by Falak, the Nightly Wailing, Sam Missile, Liam and Mountain Fox. Final Orders is next, and up to the finish, it's Falak in the lead from Happy Lad, Nightly Wailing. And Falak is going to back up his January win here, beating Nightly Wailing and Happy Lad. No Thanks was up for fourth. It's Al Ghazal in the lead from Thunder Kiss, who's challenging on the right. Then Chirakawa, Scholastic is next, being followed by Blue Shadow and Drakensberg and Kasparenko and Glorious Zoff and Pin Your Hopes. They're racing to the final furlong. Good set two between Thunder Kiss and Al Ghazal. Gone on a few lengths clear of Chirakawa, and then comes Scholastic and up to the finish. Colin Keane has clearly picked the right one of your lines is here. Thunder Kiss beat Al Ghazal, Chirakawa, and Scholastic. It's Al Ghazal in the lead from Thunder Kiss, who's challenging on the right. Then Chirakawa, Scholastic is next, being followed by Blue Shadow and Drakensberg and Kasparenko and Glorious Zoff and Pin Your Hopes. They're racing to the final furlong. Good set two between Thunder Kiss and Al Ghazal. Gone on a few lengths clear of Chirakawa, and then comes Scholastic and up to the finish. Colin Keane has clearly picked the right one of your lines is here. Thunder Kiss beat Al Ghazal, Chirakawa, and Scholastic. They're into the straight, just over two furlongs to go. Baton Rouge, Shamie Heffernan on the outside, about to pull the whip. And on the far side is Golden Lyric and Shane Foley, being followed a couple of lengths back. Princess Plumeri and Colin Keane, then Holly Gold Lightly. Abisari is on the outside, but in the lead, inside the final furlong is the favourite, Baton Rouge, opening up a couple of lengths. Advantage is drawing right away in the closing stages. Another early season maiden falls to Shamie Heffernan and Aidan O'Brien. Baton Rouge won well from Golden Lyric and Holly go lightly. They're into the straight, just over two furlongs to go. Baton Rouge, Shamie Heffernan on the outside, about to pull the whip. And on the far side is Golden Lyric and Shane Foley, being followed a couple of lengths back. Princess Plumeri and Colin Keane, then Holly go lightly. Abisari is on the outside, but in the lead, inside the final furlong is the favourite, Baton Rouge, opening up a couple of lengths. Advantage is drawing right away in the closing stages. Another early season maiden falls to Shamie Heffernan and Aidan O'Brien. Baton Rouge won well from Golden Lyric and Holly go lightly. Mishar on the left, and between them is Shore, then Stalingrad and Cotton the Wild. Mudawi is chasing them up, a bit of a break back to St. Clarence, who's followed by Ristart and then Drishiro. It's Dadil in a couple of lengths in front of Mishar, who's trying to bridge the gap. Mudawi is on the outside of Shore, inside the final 200 yards. It's Dadil and Andy Slattery from Mishar on the near side, but it's Dadil and 
the Dillon gets its turn from Misha Agap to Mudawi and Shore. Misha on the left, and between them is Shore, then Stalingrad and Cotton the Wild. Mudawi is chasing them up, a bit of a break back to St. Clarence, who's followed by Ristart and then Drishiro. It's De Dillon a couple of lengths in front of Misha, who's trying to bridge the gap. Mudawi is on the outside of Shore, inside the final 200 yards. It's De Dillon and Andy Slattery from Misha on the near side, but it's De Dillon. De Dillon gets its turn from Misha, a gap to Mudawi and Shore. They're followed by My Holy Fox and Adelisa in the middle of the track is Gigan Pressing. And then comes Miss Prance a lot and Chava Jode is next with Bellagio Man trying to pick up ground on the outside. Ginsburg is tackled by Moeline in the centre. And then Adelisa who's staying on switches to the inside. Running on to good effect is Bellagio Man and Gigan Pressing. But it's Moeline and Billy Lee in the lead from Bellagio Man. But going to the line it's a win from Moeline beating Bellagio Man a three way for the third. They're followed by My Holy Fox and Adelisa in the middle of the track is Gigan Pressing. And then comes Miss Prance a lot and Chava Jode is next with Bellagio Man trying to pick up ground on the outside. Ginsburg is tackled by Moeline in the centre. And then Adelisa who's staying on switches to the inside. Running on to good effect is Bellagio Man and Gigan Pressing. But it's Moeline and Billy Lee in the lead from Bellagio Man. But going to the line it's a win from Moeline beating Bellagio Man a three way for the third. It's Munfallad, Eckhart the green jacket on the outside and poking in in between them is Manhattan Dandy. Tipperary Moon gets on terms and they're followed by Tags Island, Palabras, Tynamite, Sister Lola the red jacket is coming with a whirlwind finish. They're inside the final furlong. Manhattan Dandy from Tipperary Moon, Sister Lola the near side. It's these three hundred yards to go. Tipperary Moon, Tipperary Moon from Sister Lola. Tipperary Moon got first run and Sister Lola and Manhattan Dandy in third. It's Munfallad, Eckhart the green jacket on the outside and poking in in between them is Manhattan Dandy. Tipperary Moon gets on terms and they're followed by Tags Island, Palabras, Tynamite, Sister Lola the red jacket is coming with a whirlwind finish. They're inside the final furlong. Manhattan Dandy from Tipperary Moon, Sister Lola the near side. It's these three hundred yards to go. Tipperary Moon, Tipperary Moon from Sister Lola. Tipperary Moon got first run and Sister Lola and Manhattan Dandy in third. They're well inside the halfway stage, a little over two furlongs to go. It's Dolce Sicily coming out of the group on the outside, as is that love, followed by Gormanston. These three almost in a line. And then Gatsby Cap being followed by Amazing One, Carey, Fascinating Spirit. And it's Is That Love who assumes command in the closing stages from Gormanston, racing up towards the finish. And it's Is That Love who has certainly caught the winning bug here of late. Second is Gormanston and Kinch from last up to third. They're well inside the halfway stage, a little over two furlongs to go. It's Dolce Sicily coming out of the group on the outside, as is that love, followed by Gormanston. These three almost in a line. And then Gatsby Cap being followed by Amazing One, Carey, Fascinating Spirit. And it's is that love who assumes command in the closing stages from Gormanston, racing up towards the finish. And it's is that love who has certainly caught the winning bug here of late. Second is Gormanston and Kinch from last up to third.